When the late Nelson Mandela was inaugurated as the first president of a democratic South Africa, he delivered an address that has become known as the speech that changed the world. Inspired by its message, the South African Indian Dance Alliance and the Playhouse Company have collaborated in a new stage production. So let's experience some Madiba magic. Presented by the Youth Wing of the South African Dance Alliance, this production formed part of the centenary celebrations of the birth of Nelson Rolislashla Mandela. Rather than retelling his life story, this show focused on the way in which the icon influenced the world through his personality and example. Madiba magic is a well-known concept. Anywhere we go in the world, we are buoyed by the magic of where we come from. Heart and art for us just come together in this wonderful idea of the centenary of Madiba's birth. And as South Africans, there's no better way for us to actually celebrate it, but through our dance and through a production. The Madiba magic theme was evoked by reinterpreting Indian classical and African traditional dance in a contemporary cross-cultural fusion of movement and gesture, as Sureka Singh explained. My choreography exemplified the theme of Madiba magic by celebrating togetherness and inclusivity, also reconciliation. So we tried to link those dances to those various themes. We wanted to also incorporate that into Madiba's message of freedom from oppression, the rights that we celebrate in our constitution. So it's a message of togetherness. And we wanted to use dance as a platform to celebrate his legacy. The story of how Madiba worked his personal magic was told by narrator Daresh Hari Pashad. Nelson Rolikla Mandela. With his beaming smile, lanky frame doing a slow shuffle, and his brightly patterned shirts, Nelson Mandela charmed the world as he planted seeds of peace, hope, reconciliation. Tonight, we present this iconic man's life through music, song, and dance. It's really special and significant to be narrating the story of Mandela, specifically, you know, as freedom came to South Africa. I think it's a powerful message in this year of Madiba, and to narrate it in the context of youth is very powerful, very special, and I think it's quite magical to listen to it all over again. The production also offered the performers an opportunity to pay a personal tribute to Madiba through their dance. Rather than being purely art for art's sake, this was a performance with a message for the audience and dancers. It's meant a lot for me to be part of uh, Madiba Magic because the guy fought for us as South Africans to be united. As a black person doing the Indian dance, it's cause of him showing that he united us to be together and become South Africans. It was also fitting that Madiba magic should be performed by the generation that has grown up post-1994 and who will pass the message on to their successors. As a dancer, I enjoyed being a part of Madiba Magic. And as a group, I feel like dance is something so amazing and so special to use it to talk about a global icon, Nelson Mandela. Dance and drama is a very appropriate medium to get this message across that we're trying to share with our audience. Because along with dance comes sound and lighting, which are also different types of mediums. And with this collaboration of these mediums, you can communicate many different types of things, emotion, mental aspects, spiritual aspects of it. I think the audience will really enjoy it. The thought for the youth wing came about when we worked on projects, we realized that it's actually the youth that are going to take it forward. And so the idea is to leave a legacy behind for the youth. From that, this production came about where they wanted to perform, you know, they're eager to do something. My message to all South Africans would be, let us all come together once again and celebrate Mandela, celebrate his thoughts, his ideals and let's celebrate his life. Let's remember what he stood for, his love for a peaceful South Africa. The theme of inclusivity was reflected in the music with ragas alongside Ma Miriam Makeba's unforgettable hits. We can only hope that Nelson Mandela's example continues to grow bright and doesn't dim over time as we continue to keep his legacy alive and serve it as a rallying point in a still developing South Africa. 
As long as we remember Madiba, his magic will live on.